all like that. So we have a nice adjustable bell crank. And now, PSTR is these tones. Um, yeah, I get to use it again. I've done something little yesterday, uh, nothing worth showing, but yeah, have my rod in there and now I need to make the pins that is gonna be sitting on those and for actually quite a few things, so yeah. That's a good one. After a couple of hours of uh, fucking around, yes, it took actually it took more than a couple of hours. It's all new to me. I have two new shoulder bolts. Yeah, let's fit it and see how it works. Okay, <coughs> that's a basic setup. So now we need. <laughs> All right, so preliminary, preliminary tests show that I had too much angle, too much lift of the, of the wing from low to high position. Uh, it was turning out to be about seven degrees according to the CFD calculation for the drug, uh, drug uh, lift ratio. That was way, 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 way too much. Um, so I needed to achieve about four and a half degrees and I got it. So this is a full lift, top-down force at all the corners. And this is four and a half degrees later, that's reduced down force, reduced drag. How I did that? Simple. We just needed the longer bell crank. And all I had to do is machine that little slotted insert, which is 30 mil long.
And just like that, my homemade DRS is finished. Oh, I'm so excited about this. Would you like to see the final product? Of course you would. Let's have a look. We have that little button controlling everything. I could not find the appropriate one. I would say DRS or spoiler or downforce or whatever. So I put NO2. And if you press it, can you hear? Turn. Yeah, you've seen it here first. That's a good one! So yeah guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, click that like button. I have a few other things that uh, I have in store, in store, in store for this video. So yeah, until the next one, bye!